in this video I talk about different diagnostics test for endogeneity and I'll show how to do those tests in programming language R in the previous review, video I explained the problem of endogeneity and showed the estimation procedure of the model using R I also discussed why instrumental variable regression is widely used technique for fixing endogeneity problem when one or more of the regressors in a is correlated with the error term in a model one of the very important conditions of of an instrument of an instrument is that the instrument should be correlated with the endogenous regressors in a model but it absolutely should not be correlated with the error term this is very important condition of instrumental variable therefore it is very important and instrumental variable method must be used with caution it is extremely important to do the diagnostic test to assess the validity of the instruments. We can run some very useful diagnostics on R. Uh, these are very straightforward and these diagnostics can help to identify whether there is a indigenity problem in a model whether the instruments are sufficiently strong enough or we can assess the whether instruments ex, we, we can assess instruments exogeneity using over identifying restrictions this can be done by weak instrument tests or Hussman test and Sargon test and I will show how to do those tests in R So in the previous video I explained the I estimated the model using R and that is the model we we use to assess the how remittance and non remittance income and the household farm side influences the household per capita food consumption expenditure. So I estimated this model in R and I explained the estimated coefficient and the parameters and the probability value of different variables so today I am going to show the diagnostics test for this and the command is summary then IV reg then we go then it goes sandwich This is the command and here is the results. We can see the line here diagnostics test weak instruments remittance and non remittance then Wahasman test then Sargon test. So what does the weak instrument mean? We have two endogenous variables in our model, remittance and non-remittance income. 
the weak instrument means the instrument has a low correlation with the endogenous explanatory variable this is very problematic if we, if we find that the instrument has a low correlation with the endogenous variable in that case the cure can be worse than the disease that is the if the instruments are weakly correlated with the endogenous explanatory variable then there is a problem so the weak instrument test can help us to assess whether the instrument is weakly correlated here we can see the probability value is statistically significant so here the null is that the instruments are weak so based on the result if it is highly significant statistically significant then null is rejected then we can decide the instruments are sufficiently strong it also true for the non remittance income variable then or hasman test whether instrumental variable is consistent as ordinary least square here the null is that they are equally consistent so as the, the this is uh, as the probability is statistically significant then it means that instrumental variable is consistent where it is not and sargon test this is a test of instruments exogeneity using our identifying restrictions called the jest statistics in this talk and version it can be useful if we have more instruments than endogenous regressors in a model and in that case if we have uh, more than if we have more instruments in the uh, for the endogenous regressors and if the null is rejected it means that at least one of the instruments at least one of the instruments uh, is invalid so these are the three most important diagnostic tests and we can do those diagnostic tests with a, with a simple as uh, in a single line command and these are available in the aer package and make sure you install the aer package before doing that thank you very much for watching